Greetings from Bagram Airfield. This is your AFN Afghanistan Freedom Watch update. I'm Senior Airman Chan Smith. The ability to provide logistical, aerial, and on-base support in Afghanistan is all dependent on the availability of fuel. Petty Officer Cody Hitson shows us what it takes to provide fuel throughout the country. Fuel is a commodity as crucial as bullets for operations in Afghanistan. Thanks to refueling points, such as the one at Ford Operating Base Finti in Jalalabad, it remains readily available to military assets throughout the country. They download about 100,000 gallons a day from Pakistan, the trucks behind me, and then we'll upload about 50 to 75,000 gallons a day to push out to our locations. We support fuel to our entire task force, and we have approximately 22 locations. So this location is it's in a good spot so that we can reach all of our locations within Task Force Bastogne. Task Force Bastogne's area of operation is composed of two provinces in Afghanistan's volatile northeast. So delivering up to 2.1 million gallons of fuel per month typically means long convoys on dangerous roads. One step in ensuring the fuel arrives safely is a mandatory fuel truck inspection. Initially, before we started doing the inspections, we would send 30 trucks up uh, to a place called Bostik, and maybe five or six of them would actually make it. Since we've started doing the inspections, the truck uh, serviceability has, has improved dramatically. So it's much better with the inspections. Everything's going much better and we're not losing near as much as what we did in the past. And more gas means more support to troops, both on base and in forward outposts. Reporting from Forward Operating Base Vinci in Jalalabad, Afghanistan, I'm Petty Officer Cody Hitson.